Hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How, do, how are you doing today? Good evening, teacher. Hi. Oh, nice. Very good. Good evening. It's good to see you this last Friday, right? Last day of the week. Me too, teacher. Oh, Happy nice. Happy Friday, everyone, you too. teacher. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. Hi, Adriana. Hi, teacher. How do you feel today? Mm, so, so tighter. A little, you can say a little tighter. A little, ah, a little tighter. Mm -hmm. I imagine it's Friday, so it's 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 okay. I mean, it's the last day of the week, right? Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Hi, teacher. I see something different in Miguel today. I don't know what 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 I see different in Miguel. <laughs> Ana Michelle, what do you think? What difference do you see in Miguel today? Mm, I you see no, no difference. You see no difference. <laughs> really? <La barba>. no. <laughs> yes. Yes. Uh -huh. yes. The beard. The beard. Beer. The beard. That's right. Beer. <laughs> All right. Yeah, that's the difference. Yes, yes. Hi, Mayra. <laughs> Hi, good evening. Good evening. I didn't see you yesterday. Yes. Ah. Missing. Yeah, she was yeah. missing. Ah, you had a little problem. Yeah. Okay. I hope you solve it. You solve it. <laughs> yes, it's okay. All right. Thanks, God. Hi, Darwin. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? <clears throat> I'm very well. Nice. Very good. Are you going to work this Sunday or tomorrow? Uh, not. No, it's okay. My day off. Oh, tomorrow and Sunday or only tomorrow? Uh, tomorrow and Sunday. Okay, so I you have. Yeah, you two work days. two days. You yeah. have two, two days off. Yes. Ah, so that means you work from Monday to Friday. It's correct. Oh, good. So that means that tomorrow you are going fishing, right? And Sunday you are going fishing. No. <laughs> no, no. It, tomorrow I visit the church. Yeah. Ah. Interesting. How often, how often do you go fishing? Is, ¿cómo sería? How do you say tengo pensado? I am thinking, I, I am thinking think about, about go to the fish, the, the, El próximo mes. Ah, the next month. The next the month. Next month. Ah, the next the month. Next month. Because it's my vacation. Oh, interesting. Very good. Excellent. So it's a good option. Yes. Yes. All right. Very good. Hi, Jancy. Osmin. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How do you feel today? Good, very good. Very good because it's Friday. <laughs> no, it's yeah, exactly. Uh, tomorrow rest. Tomorrow? Tomorrow rest in my house. Yes, I imagine. It's your day off, right? You don't work on Saturdays and Sundays. No, no, no. Yeah. Okay. Now, um, how how do you say un día sí un día no? Uh, maybe you can say um, once um, every fifteen days. You can say once every or one Saturday every fifteen days. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Do you re do you remember how we say quincena? I don't remember in English. 
que I remember know, like, we started this. Recuerdo que estudiamos lo de la quincena. But I don't remember right now. No, you don't remember. Okay, right investigate. Now, don't... You don't remember. Investigate and tell me, okay? I want to know, all right? I, I, Please. I, I invest... All yeah. right, very good. So let's start then. Uh, so welcome to this uh, last day of the week, Friday, right? So welcome. I know that this day is very tiring because today is the last day of work and you have like many things to do in your work, okay? Some people work tomorrow, but Saturday is like more relaxed commonly, okay? But Friday is, is busy and heavy, okay? So I, I imagine many, many people are tired here, okay? But it's the last day. Tomorrow and Sunday, you can rest, okay? So let's start. Let me pass the attendance and you say here, present, or I'm here if you want, okay? So let's start with the attendance. Uh, Ada? Adriana? Present. Ana Michelle. Present. Angela. Present, teacher. Very good. Asalia. Present. Excellent. Darwin. Present, teacher. Great. Flor. Present. Okay. Gloria. Gloria. <coughs> Not present yet. Okay. Carla. Carla, hello. No, not connected yet. Okay. Margarita? I'm here. Okay, perfect. Mayra? Present. Oh, ya le estaba poniendo una asistencia, Mayra. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. All right, let's see Miguel. Present teacher. Very good. Nelson? Not present yet. Okay. Ophelia? Ophelia? Okay. Rafael? Rosa? Present teacher. Hey. Okay, excellent. Um, let me see. Sandra? Sandra? Jansi, Jansi, I think your microphone is not working, Jansi. Creo que no está funcionando tu micrófono. Tal vez lo puedes revisar antes de que iniciemos. Ah, now it's better. Now, now it works. Ahora sí, now it works. I think you are too far then. Está demasiado lejos. You are too far. You are too far. Zulma? Edwin, Ingrid, Lourdes, present, Oscar, present, very good, it's good to see you back Oscar, I didn't see you yesterday, I, it's okay, you texted me, okay, it's good to see you here, Susana, okay, very good, uh, so it's time to continue then, sorry, me, no, I'm sorry, Osmin. Oh my God, I didn't mention you. ¿Por qué será que me salto Osmin? My goodness. Let me see here. Yeah. Me, teacher, Carla. Osmin. Yes, teacher. All right. Present. Okay. Carla, right? Okay. Ah, but I mentioned Thank Carla. <laughs> okay, very good. Okay, let's, la, let's continue then. Um, so do you remember uh, what we studied yesterday? What was like the main or central topic yesterday? Do you remember? Um, what was the central topic yesterday? Uh, Don't remember? The activities. Ah, um, exactly. Activities regular in the work. Yes, it's like schedule activities in the simple present, okay? Schedule activities in the, sim in the simple present. Like for example, when you say, I work uh, or I, I arrive to work at 8 a.m., all right? So it's a schedule activity. Or I check email uh, in the morning. It's a schedule activity, right? Yeah? 
So uh, we studied the simple present for a schedule activities. And if we use third person, he, she, or it, what do we do in the verb? ¿Qué hacemos con el verbo? What do we do in the verb? Put the is. Put is. Okay, so basically you put the letter? Is. S, S, S right? S, S. Yes. Or ES, it depends. All right, that's, that's correct. So basically we put the letter S, that's correct, okay? Uh, for example, you say uh, she visits, he goes, uh, he studies, he listens, all right? So we put the letter S, okay? Thank you very much for your opinions. Now, I want you to take a moment, look at this picture here. I have a picture, okay? I have a little girl and I have a clock. And these uh, pictures, or you see, you see the same girl doing different activities, all right? Some regular activities. All right, so I want you to take a moment, look at the picture and think about the activities she does. Think about the activities she does. For example, number one is she takes a shower at six, all right? She takes a shower at six. Think, only think, don't tell me. Only think, solo piensen, no me digan ahorita. Don't write, no, no deben escribir, you don't have to write, okay? Only think about the activities, the possible activities for this little girl. Okay, are you ready? Yes? Okay, uh, let me expand here the, the viewer so I see more of you. So please, um, okay, let me expand it a little bit. Okay, here. Okay, let's see, uh, let's, let's look at this, um, at this photo. What does she do? Read. She reads, she reads, she reads a book about, okay, no, this one, only this one, okay, only this one, okay, she reads a book at about three, right, at about three, very good, what does she do on this picture? She's drawing, she draws, playing games, Draw. Maybe you can say uh, she plays games, ah. she draws, or she does homework, maybe, okay? She does okay. homework, you can say, all right? Very good, she excellent. Maybe you can say she does homework, okay? At one, yeah, I think it's 1 p.m., right? I guess, all right. Now look at this picture. From, from 1 p.m. to 2 p.m. From 1 p.m. to 2 p.m., exactly. Okay, so what about picture number uh, three, this one? This photo. What does she do? She takes, she takes off online class. Maybe, yeah, maybe she takes online she checks, class. She checks her emails. She checks her, her email or her Facebook, I don't know, right? Maybe her Facebook, her email, yeah. or she uses the computer. You can say to make it more general, okay? She uses the computer. From five to four. To four. Okay. From four to five, sorry. Four to five. <laughs> From four to five, sorry. Uh, what about this one? A six. It's a shower. It's a shower. Ah, exactly. You say she takes 
a shower. A shower. Excellent. Uh -huh. She takes a shower at six. Uh, what about um, this one? She's got a bed. Ah, exactly. You can say she goes, goes, because we are in the simple present regular activities or scheduled activities, okay? She goes to bed. She goes to bed at about eight, seven or eight. Very good. What about nine? She brushes her teeth. Exactly, lower this. She brushes, brushes, you say brushes, right? She brushes her teeth. What about this one? She does. She does exercise? Yes. yes. She does work up. Maybe you can say she does exercise or she works she out. Run. Or she, she goes, runs. she runs, she goes running. She, run, run. she goes running, okay? She, she goes, goes running. Run. She goes running, she exercises, or she does exercise, or she works out. But mainly workout, cuando decimos workout, es mayormente para el gimnasio, okay? For the gym, all right? Workout. Yes, is mainly for the gym, all right? Good. And the last picture. What is the activity? What does she do? The dancing. She's dancing? Yeah, but, but if you tell me she's dancing, you are telling me the activity in the moment. And what I want is to mention the regular activity. She, she, she wears she, uniform? Yeah. Think. It's okay, but you better say she dances. She in dances the, at 12. She dances at 12, all right? Because the idea is to use the she's happy. She's happy, that's right, real information. She's happy because she dances at 12, all right? Very good, so I repeat, the idea is that you use the simple present. And in the simple present, you don't say she's dancing, no, because she's, she's dancing is not a regular activity. It's a, an action in the moment, okay, so it's different. So I will repeat the examples, like kind of, as you told me, all right? So for, let me clarify first, okay? Uh, so for this one, uh, she does homework from one to two. She reads, because it's present simple, she reads a book at 3 p.m. <laughs> she uses her computer from four to five. She takes a shower at six. Uh, maybe you can say she sleeps, right? She sleeps from seven to eight. She sleeps from seven to eight. She brushes her teeth. She goes running, she goes running, and she dances at 12, you can say. All right, so this is just to practice, okay? This is just to practice. Maybe one thing to mention is that we use the simple present to talk about a schedule or regular activities, okay? That is the idea of the simple present. Now let's do another activity. In the, on the, in the following activity, we have... Uh, Okay, hold on a second. We have some questions, okay? So um, basically, okay, let me move something here. Question number one is, what is a regular day like in your workplace? It's a question, okay? I forgot the question mark, sorry. What is a regular day like in your workplace? ¿Cómo es un día regular en tu trabajo? What is a regular day like in your workplace? And you can say, we. Oui. We start work at 7 a.m. Or you can say work. You can use this vocabulary to describe your regular day, okay? Pueden usar este vocabulario para describirlo, okay? So you can say, for example, uh, we open the company at 8 p.m., 8 a.m., I don't know. We arrive to work at 7.45. We close the company at 5 p.m., okay? Uh, we go to check merchandise. We listen. We speak with the manager, we have meetings, I don't know, right? So the idea is that you speak about the regular day in your workplace, okay? Teacher, I have a question. What is your question? Uh, what's the meaning like in this sentence? Como? Como? The teacher. Yes. Uh, in the question, that said yesterday, uh, like uh, was in a last word. Exactly. N now is a middle mm -hmm. question. 
Yeah, but, but it's like, this is an extra compliment. But if you, if you see, what is a regular day like? So this is like a compliment, okay? Like in your okay. company. <laughs> okay. But it is commonly, commonly after the phrase that uses is or are, okay? In this case, a regular day, which is like the, the subject, okay? Okay. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, what is a regular day like? What and like are used together. Son usados juntos. El what y el and what and like, okay? Y, no, y juntos hacen la palabra en español como. Okay, what is a regular day like? Como es un día regular, okay? So you translate them together and they are used together. What and like, okay? Teacher, Ahora sí. lo, ex, lo voy a explicar yo para ver si, si yo comprendí ayer. Okay, thank you very much. <laughs> okay. Eh, usamos like en una pregunta cuando, dice, cuando inicia con what. Si solo dejamos la pregunta, what is a regular day? Ahí dice qué es un día regular. No dice cómo. cómo. Ajá, no dice cómo, pero ya ah. si le, le ponemos el like, la transforma en cómo. Entonces ya se puede, el significado cambia y dice cómo es un día regular. ¿Sí? I have a question. Yeah, yes, yes, Oscar. Thank you, it's Carla. In, it's incorrect if I say how is a regular day yes, in your workplace. Yes, it's incorrect. I, I mean, no, no, that's correct, sorry, oh. that's correct. It's Don't correct. Lie. You don't use like, right? You only no. say how. How is a regular day in your in workplace? Your, in your workplace. Yeah, it's correct. This form. Ah, okay. It's correct. Yeah, but it's, es lo que hablábamos con Carla, me parece. Que se decía Carla que se mira como más bonito decirlo con like. What is a regular day like in your workplace? But you can say that, Oscar, too. It's possible to say how. Ambas son correctas, teacher. Yes, yes. Teacher. Yeah. Pero no podría ir how is a regular day like in your workplace. No, impossible. No, okay. no. if so you no use was... how, only how. Uh -huh. Okay. So if you use how, you say how is a regular day in your workplace, only that. Okay? How is a regular day in your, in workplace? your workplace? Exactly. Uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Okay, are you ready? In this case, you don't have to write the answers. Aquí tal vez no deben escribir las respuestas. Ahí tienen ya el vocabulario que van a usar, okay? So if you ask me, for example, if you ask me, Bernardo, uh, what is a regular, a regular day like in your workplace? So I start describing my day. And I say, uh, we start work uh, at 7.30 a.m. We open the school at 6.30 at 6 a.m. Um, I arrive to work um, 15 to seven, all right? Uh, we close the school at 5 p.m. And we speak with the principal um, in the morning sometimes. We almost never have meetings. We almost never have meetings. We, or we never have meetings. Um, I never check email. And visit clients, well, I don't visit clients, right? But that's my, my regular day, all right? Now you will speak about your regular day in your company, okay? So are you ready? Si quieren hagan una captura de pantalla para que tengan el vocabulario en la mano, okay? So you don't have to write the examples. You don't have to write the examples. Thank you, teacher. Okay, so make a screenshot. Make a screenshot. Teacher, tengo una pregunta. I have a question. I have a question. Well, yes, I have a question. What is your uh, question? Yes, between start and work, uh, no tiene que ir to. No, no. No, because in this, no, no, it's unnecessary because in this case, work is not a verb, it's a noun. It's not a verb, it's a oh. noun. Empiezo el trabajo, okay? So it's not a empiezo, it's not empiezo a trabajar, okay? Okay. Yeah, if I want to say, si yo quisiera decir empiezo a trabajar, sí, I start to work, okay? 
-huh. pero como yo quiero decir, okay. empiezo mi trabajo, empiezo el trabajo, so I start work. Uh -huh. Ok. All right. Very good. So are you ready? Steady? Yes. Ok. So we are going to practice in groups and take turns asking the question, all right? Take turns asking the question. Tomen turnos haciéndose la pregunta. Take turns asking the, the question, all right? Do you have any question about the activity? No questions? No, teacher. Thank you. Okay, very good. Let's go to practice then. Let's go to practice. Okay. We may what? Who is that? What question? Do you have the question? Oscar, do you have the question? Yeah, yes. What, what is the page? Uh, actually, that, that, that's not on any page. All right. Maybe the question, but not the verbs. Okay. Because it's an activity. It's an activity I created with the verbs. Okay. Uh, so you better, if you want to look at the question, go to the screenshot. Mejor vayan a la captura que hicieron. Go to the screenshot you made, okay? Okay, teacher. Yeah, it's better. Uh, estamos en la uh, captura. Bueno, eh, hay que preguntarle al compañero y tiene que utilizar esas palabras del vocabulario. Yes. Yes. Exactly, exactly. Okay. Right. So the question is, what is a regular day like in your workplace? So you mm -hmm. ask somebody and they answer, I work or I arrive to work at 7 a.m. I blah, 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 and you continue, okay? okay. <laughs> Oscar, what is a regular day like in your workplace? Can you repeat it? I... Oscar casi no le escuchamos, como que tiene lejos de... Okay, can you hear me? Thank you. Okay. Yes. Uh, can, can you repeat the question, please? What is a regular day like in your workplace? Okay, I start, I start my work at 7 a.m. I check my emails and answer any question of many people. Okay, at 7.30 o'clock, I have a, me a meeting with my boss in another country. And we talk about any problems. Uh, 83 o'clock, I drink a lot of coffee. Yes, because I like. Um, um, I have two cups in my, in my desk. And, and I work in a human, record, human resource department. Um, recruitment, search people, interview and I take my my how do you say the uh, my lunch I have my lunch at 1 p.m. Uh, I don't know continued my 
my word and have a second meaning. And I have two meaning a day with my boss for, for many, many situations. Um, 4 p.m., drink, more coffee. Um, Lourdes, what is your regular day like in your play, workplace? Okay. Um, in my workplace, I I start um, I start my work at eight a.m. Uh, then I I call uh, to my co-workers. <coughs> Perdón, sorry. My co-workers um, to talk about uh, the sales routes. And then I I check my email around the eight half a.m. Uh, after that, I I answer the the calls or the emails and and I check. Uh, my schedule in in my in my computer um, then i i have uh, sometimes i have meeting with my boss uh, to talk about the customers uh, about the strategies or the goals uh, in the in the month and then i have my lunch from 12 to 2 and then i return my my work um to to 2 p.m after that i I continue with answer. Excellent. Excellent. Good. Okay. <laughs> Good. Okay. Cute. Excellent. My Next. day is very easy. Very easy. Me quedé muda. <laughs> And uh, what about you, Michelle? Ay, espérenme un segundito que estoy armándolo todavía. I play video games, Mario Bros. No. Ah. Y que es un diálogo solamente con. No, mi hija está jugando con un compañerito. Así que por eso estoy oh. del otro lado ahí. ¿eh? <laughs> Pero se escucha bien bonito. Sí, yes, es Mario, Mario, the, Mario, Mario. Mario. Super Mario Bros. Super Mario Bros. No, no, no. Yo de juegos no sé nada. Apenas veo televisión y tengo días de no ver, por cierto. <laughs> And then um, I leave work around 5 p.m. Um, my days are very soft, um, but are interesting. Uh, usually the days more busy are uh, the end of the month because we need to, to send all the um tickets or oh, facturas no recuerdo ahorita cómo se dice facturas bills invoices 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 okay um <clears throat> we send to a uh, invoice or tickets to the commercial area uh, for they pays Uh, the um, los gastos no recuerdo cómo se dice uh, to the Depenses. other 
expenses. 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 Uh, to the others, um, okay. to the others, uh, co-workers. And that's interesting, my job. Okay. Creo que se nos unió Susana, Good evening y Ingrid. Can you give me what is the exercise? The exercise is we need to talk about our days at work. Answering the questions. What is a regular day like in your workplace? I <laughs> <laughs> okay, in, in the okay. middle of the night. Back my work and to finish my work and 40, 40, no, 4.45 p.m. Then I go to the gym and I come back to home 7 a.m. and start English class at 8 p.m. And finally, I go to the bed 11 p.m. o'clock. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Excellent. Okay. Uh, ask you, Adriana. Ask you uh, Adriana. Yes. What Adriana. a day. What a day. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I... Maybe, no, ¿Cómo sería? Uh, some days I don't go, I didn't go to the gym. Okay, I don't go to the gym. I don't go. I, 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 don't, I don't go. go. Ah, I, I don't go, go to the gym. Yeah, yeah. All right. <laughs> okay. For the class, for the class. <laughs> okay. What is, uh, Adriana, what is a regular day like in your workplace? My regular day in my workplace, uh, first I start a work at 9, 9 a.m. Because, uh, because my work is... Um, it's far, it's far. And, and usually my activities, uh, I check emails uh, in the morning. Then I supervisor in the, in the no, supervisor employees in the plan from 10, a.m. to 10.45 a.m. And I take a lunch at uh, 12 o'clock. Then usually um, I attend meetings with my boss. Um, then uh, Mm, then I arrive in my house at six or six thirty, and usually, uh, well, no, 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 every day, and then, then, then my work. No, the put them in the Them, them. After work. After. Them after, after work, work. After work, eh, I made a cook at seven o'clock. And then eh, I take a class at eight o'clock. 8 p.m. o'clock. And mm -hmm. I go to the bed at uh, 11 o'clock. 
Finish. <laughs> okay, excellent, Adriana. Okay, finish everything. <laughs> okay, ya se acabó esto. Ay, bien. pues ya no sacó. <laughs> <laughs> I was only waiting for you. I was only waiting for you. <laughs> okay, okay, teacher. Okay. See you. Bye bye. Thanks a lot. bye. Okay, uh well. Just one thing, all right? If you want to say, if you want to say, me voy, de, me voy del trabajo o salgo de trabajar in English, you can say, I leave. I leave work, okay? I leave work. Salgo del trabajo, okay? Uh, for example, you can say, I leave work at 7 p.m., for example, or I leave work at 5 p.m., I don't know, all right? Leave, okay? De dejar o partir, leave, okay? So Thank that's you. the way you I say don't it. remember. Yes. Yeah. Now you remember. <laughs> okay, very good. Uh, so I just want to listen to like three opinions, right? Uh, let's see. I want to listen to Floor's voice today. So Floor, uh, what is a day like? Uh, what is a regular day like in your workplace, Floor? Teacher, I I start um I arrive at my work at 8 a.m. They check and send my email. Um, then I am, I have a meeting with my workplace. The 12, um, I lunch. I have uh, my lunch. Uh, the 3 p.m. I drink a, a cup coffee, <laughs> and finally my uh, my day in my work at 5 p.m. Okay, maybe you can say I leave work at 5 p.m. I leave work. I leave. <laughs> Work, work at 5 p.m. At 5 p.m. Yes. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much, Floor. So can you please go to reactions and give thumbs up for Floor? Go to reactions, go to reactions and give her thumbs up, please. Okay, vamos a reacciones and let's give her thumbs up, okay? Thumbs up. Thank you very much, Floor. Okay, now let's listen to a boy. Um, I have a long time not listening to, let me see, I, I am looking for, to Nelson. I have a long time not listening to Nelson in the, like in public here, all right? So Nelson, uh, what is a regular day like in your workplace? Where um, I, I arrive at 6 40 a.m. and I start I start work at 7 a.m. After that, I uh, turn off the, my computer and check uh, or mail. Uh, I, I request uh, many emails, uh, the vendor, the, my job, uh, the con cole, uh, other person. Uh, only the only work. Uh, after that, uh, I check all platform, the system. Um, uh, anyone, I I so I, I I give support because uh, any any problem, the file uh, the keep them or other question. But uh, after that. Uh, checks uh, the report, the the service, uh, the business, and in the in the afternoon, uh, I check, uh, I write it only report, and maybe 
a checks a platform uh, the system only good up only up um, because uh, I have the the good service at uh, the at the claim. Um, leaving 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 5 p.m. 5 p.m. Yes, um, I go I go back to my home and 6 p.m. South okay. South. Okay, excellent, very good. Thank you, Nelson. Thank you very much. You can say I leave work, okay? I leave, I leave work at 6 p.m. or 5 p.m. I, I don't remember. Uh, just one question for, for, for you, Nelson. Um, in the morning, you turn on or you turn off your computer? You turn on. Ah, uh, turn on. Turn on, yes. on, on, all right? Turn yes. on, because you say turned off, all yes. right? But it's okay. It's different. Okay. Yeah, okay. so you say turn on. Maybe in the afternoon, you turn off the computer because <laughs> yes. you leave, okay? You leave work to go to your house, okay? I got it. Okay, yeah. Okay, thank you very much, Nelson. So everyone, please go to reactions again and let's give him thumbs up, all right? Please. Go to reactions and let's give thumbs up, thumbs up for Nelson. Okay, one last participation, a volunteer. One last participation, a volunteer. A volunteer? Oh my God, it is so difficult to find volunteers here. Me teacher. <laughs> All right, Margarita. Okay, Margarita, uh, what is a regular day like in your workplace? Okay, I start my work at 7.30 a.m. Yeah. First, check email and my scheduled meetings. Then, prepare different reports for my boss and general manager. I take my lunch at middle time. Then, back my work is correct. Back, back to my, my work. work. Back to my work. Back, uh, back to my work. Maybe, maybe in the, in the Margarita, maybe in the sentence you can this, say, I get back to my work. Get back. Regreso a mi trabajo. Uh, yeah. I get uh, back. Uh, get back yes. to my work. Okay, continue. And finish my work at 40, 4, 45 p.m. Then I go to the gym some days <laughs> and I come back to home 7 p.m. o'clock and start English class at 8 p.m. o'clock. And finally, I go to the bed at 11 p.m. Oh, nice. Interesting. All right. Very good. I like it. I asked about the, the work, but she gave more information, and I really like that. Okay. Thank you very much, Margarita. Thank you very much. Okay. Very good. Uh, so I want to listen to everyone. Okay. Unfortunately, I can't, but I know everybody practiced. Okay. So just don't forget. Uh, when we talk about these kind of activities, we use the simple present, okay? And the structure is subject, verb, in present, complement, and a time expression, okay? Like for example, I, subject, leave, verb, work, complement, I leave work at 5 p.m., time expression, okay? So that's the structure for a sentence in the simple present. Okay, so do you have any question about this? No, right? Or, you, or yes, do you have any questions about this? No? Or yes? No, all right. I think no. everybody's silent, I infer uh, you have no questions. Okay, very good. Uh, let's go to today's content. And in today's content, um, let me show it to you here. Let me show it to you here. All right, so and in today's content, um, okay, let me close this. All right, oh my goodness. And in today's content, uh, we have um, information related to marketing strategies, okay? And we have, as always, we have two discussion questions, okay? Question number one is, what is an important strategy? Let's talk about restaurants. What is an important strategy restaurants could implement to get more clients? Okay, or to get the attention of more clients. So think of a strategy. I don't know. 
Maybe you can say, um, the restaurant can change the menu or they can have promotions every day or they can have the plate or the dish of the day. Plato del día, the dish of the day. I don't know, all right? So it's your answer. Question number two. What are some successful restaurants you know? What is successful? Éxito. Exitosos. Exitosos. Exitosos, okay? So what are some successful restaurants you know, all right? And then you say the name of the restaurants, okay? Yeah, uh, Burger King or, or Wendy's or Papa Jones, I don't know, all right? Or other restaurants, you know, okay? So please take some time and answer the two questions. The questions are on page number 21. Page number 21, okay? Okay, teacher, okay. In question number one, only one strategy, okay? Only one, not two, only one strategy. What is an important strategy, one strategy, okay? And in question number two, like maybe you can mention three or four restaurants, okay? Successful restaurants. Restaurant personal teacher. Sorry? Personal teacher. Exactly, exactly. Maybe in question number two, some answers will be similar, okay? But in question number one, maybe some answers will be similar, but not all the answers, okay? I guess in the question number one, sure. you will have different answers. Yes? Is food dishes para decir platos de comida? You only say dish. When you say dish, the meaning is inferred. Se infiere, okay, que es de comida, dish. Ah, okay. O sea, como cuando uno dice platillos. Dishes. Los platos del menú, dishes. Uh So the question is on page number 21, okay? Because I will close this uh, window. Page number 21, okay? Okay. Uh, the same, when you finish, please go to reactions and raise your hand, okay? Okay. I can see Osmin finished. Thank you very much, Osmin. Okay, thank you. Adriana too, thank you, Adriana. Oh, she lowered hand quickly. <laughs> Bye. Flor, just to remind you, today you have the one-on-one -on -one session, okay? Don't forget. <laughs>
teacher. Yeah. Cuando ocupo search or look. Um, search is mainly for internet uh, matters, okay? Like search for something on the internet, okay? Search uh, some information, for example, okay? And look for is like to look for something like in your house. But, but, but some people ejemplo, use it the same. Some people use it the same and no problem, all right? I am searching for something in my house or I am looking for something in my house. It's the same, same purpose. Okay. Yeah. Okay, in three minutes, uh, you need to have the answers, okay? In three minutes, at nine exactly. In question number two, you don't have to mention a very famous restaurant, right? There are some small restaurants which are like, um, let's see, let's say very, very, very regular or people visit them very much, okay? Or they are somehow famous, but they are small, all right? They are successful is the word, okay? There are some small restaurants and they are very successful. So you can mention these restaurants too, not necessarily Wendy's, Biggest or Papa John's or the Pizza Hut, all right? Teacher, I have a question with a expression. Yes, Susana. When you say in español para que me entienda. Yeah, it's okay. Cuando usted dice, eh, por ejemplo, en mi casa que quería dejar. Me gusta algo que sirven en tal lugar. Digo, sirven o venden. ¿Qué es mejor en el caso por la traducción? If you are talking about food, you say serve. Like serve. 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 Ah. For example, you can say, I like the food they serve in, and you say the name of the restaurant, okay? For example, you can say, I like um, the pupusas they serve in Olocuilta, okay? Yes? Yeah. Okay. This is when you're talking about food. You can say serve, okay? One minute. Well, like 50 seconds. Okay, time is over. Okay, uh, so basically we have two questions, right? So in the meantime, uh, the two questions are, question number one, what is an important strategy restaurants could implement to get more clients? Strategy, the pronunciation is strategy, strategy, strategy. The pronunciation for this is implement, all right? Implement, to get more clients, all right? So I will repeat the whole question. What is an important strategy restaurants could implement to get more clients? Question number two. What are some successful restaurants you know? So the pronunciation for exitoso, successful, 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 all right? 
So the question, what are some successful restaurants you know? All right, you know. Very good. So we have two clients, two, two questions, sorry, two clients. Oh my God. We have two, two questions, okay? And the questions are on page number 21, okay? So listen up, listen up, all right? And this time I want you to do it very well, all right? Very well. So we will go to breakout rooms to practice the two questions, okay? So take turns asking the questions in the group, okay? And when we come back, you will report. Cuando regresemos a la sesión principal, van a reportar acerca de sus compañeros. Pero no me pueden usar preguntas. The same. You can use questions. You don't say, for example, for question number one, Melanie, um, I will give you one example. For question number one, Melanie, um, some successful restaurants are. No, that's not an answer. When you report, you say, cuando reportamos decimos, um, Melanie thinks, for example, okay? Melanie thinks that some successful restaurants are, okay, that's a complete answer. Esa es una, una forma de reportar información. Melanie thinks, or you can say Melanie said. Melanie said that some important restaurants or successful restaurants are, or uh, you can even say Melanie told me. Melanie me dijo, Melanie told me that some, in, some successful restaurants are, and you mentioned the list of, of restaurants, okay? And for question number one, you can say, no me van a decir, okay, Melanie, question number one, Melanie, Melanie, uh, some important restaurants, blah, no, 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 all right, so you will say, for example, um, Melanie thinks, okay, uh, Melanie thinks that, let me see, question number one, Okay, Melanie thinks that an important strategy restaurants would implement to get more clients is uh, to promote new products, for example, okay? Yeah, so I need a complete answer. Necesito una respuesta completa al momento de compartir, okay? Yeah? Important, it's important, that important? Strategy. A strategy or... No. Yeah, you can say, for example, Melanie, Melanie said that, uh -huh. or Melanie thinks that an important strategy restaurants could implement to get more clients is, and then you say the strategy. Y luego dicen la estrategia, okay? Yeah? Yeah? Okay. Okay, <laughs> okay. so this is when you report. Yeah. Esto es cuando reporten. Right now, go and ask the questions, okay? Ahorita si vayan y hagan las preguntas. This is when you report, okay? Yes, any questions? No? No, teacher. Okay, so let's go and practice the questions. And when we come back, cuando regresemos, van a reportar, you will report, okay? Yeah? Okay, let's go and practice then. Let's go and practice then. I will make groups of three only, okay? So you have a lot of chances to practice. Okay, let's go to practice. Okay. Uh, let me let me share the, the question. Okay. 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 Question, do you see my screen? Yes, I can see. Okay, okay. Uh, uh, who's first? Who's first? You're first, Susan? The ladies, yes, the ladies. Yes, okay. the ladies, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. In my case, you make me the question or only say that? You, you, you. You say the question, uh, Darwin, ah, okay. or to me? Ah, okay. Okay, Miguel, what is an important strategy restaurants could implement to get more clients? Uh, I think that that's important strategy restaurant, uh, it's a create affordable promotions. Mm -hmm. Affordable affordable promotions. Create affordable promotions. 
Mm -mm. I don't know if do? you take the affordable, affordable, this uh, promotion is, is affordable. A, afford, affordable. Como accesible, preso accesible, algo así? No entiendo la palabra. Ajá, ok. Uh, the word is, este, promo, es como promociones al alcance del bolsillo, pero. Eh, ah, ok. That's the intention. Como, It's ok. That's the intention okay. of the word. Ok, ok. Ok, thank you. Ok, um, uh, this is the, 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 first, the first answer. Okay. What are some uh, successful restaurants you know? Uh, <clears throat> the successful uh, restaurant I know is uh, Tony Roma's. Vamos Fernando. Okay. Uh, what is an important strategy, a strategy restaurants could implement, could implement to get more clients? I think that the most important strategy of a restaurant is is have a chef with a skill and the and, and knowledge of a special food that offer. For example, if the restaurant is a Peruvian cuisine, it's necessary have a chef Peruvian because obviously only a chef does know this typical food of Peruvia is uh, is who that that uh, cook the best ways the each uh, dish. Okay. Okay. And in this in the second, what are some successful restaurants you know? Uh, I think that the successful, successful restaurant is good with the best ingredients because one dish prepared with the best ingredients do the a difference be, because when you eat uh, some dish cooked with the better ingredients is a different the sour and quality uh, food. Okay. Uh, I didn't hear the, the name. Can you repeat, please? What name? Uh, me dijo el nombre del restaurante. No. no. Uh, the, my ah, example ah. was, where, for example, is a restaurant is a Peruvian uh, cuisine. Mm -hmm. Necessary that have a Peruvian chef. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Yes. For example. Okay, Oscar, what is the important strategy restaurant could implement to get more clients? I think in general, restaurant in El Salvador show use fresh eager. Ah, uh, yes. It's very important. Why? How? I watch many plays, use, uh, how do you say enlatados? Enlatados? Um, <laughs> let me see. Um, canel? Canel enlatados? Ah, how do you say enlatados? Comida enlatada. You say canned food. Canned, canned food. Mm. Canned, but with ED, ah, right? Okay. Canned. Let me write it for you. I, I watch more restaurants canned. use canned food for. Ah, canned, canned. Canned. Okay. You say canned. Canned, canned. canned food. Canned, canned food. Canned. canned food. Yeah. They, they use canned, canned food. No, you, you don't say canned, you say canned. Canned food. Canned food. Okay, they use canned food. Canned food. Yes. Um, you, and, and the quality 
very loud. If you travel to some countries, they have a culture for cooking. Cocina. For? They cocina. They are for cocina. How do you say? Kitchen. Kitchen? Cuisine. Ah, cuisine. Cuisine. Mm. Ah, okay. They have a, cool, a cuisine culture. Yeah. Cuisine. And no necessary expensive restaurant. No, the street food. Yeah, for the chicken, Tony Romas. It's a hot Tony Romas. Yeah, Pam, for her chanting. Okay. Lo se oye. Okay. Bastante. Okay. Uh -huh. And you, who is the next? Yes. Yes. Ready? You th think? Things that important restaurant implement to get more clients is? Is a good, good customer service, sell good product and home service. Good customer services. Exactly. Good okay. customer services. Share good product and home service. Good product. Pro, uh, product and home service. Home service, yes. Number service. Number two. Number two. You uh, said you said that some successful restaurants are. Uh, I I like to please a hat for your camper. You 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 say camper chicken is good and Tony rooms also. You say pollo campero is a proper noun, okay? And in English, you don't translate pollo proper campero. nouns into English. Say pollo campero, okay? Oh, okay. Yes. Okay. Camper chicken. No. No. Okay. The, the problem is that in English, uh, you don't translate proper nouns. And pollo campero is a proper noun, like Tony Romas and all this, all right? You don't say Tony Roms. Okay. No, you say Tony Romas, all right? Tony Romas. Okay. Exactly. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Please have pollo campero and Tony Romas. Vaya, Michelita. Huh? Think that important restaurant implement to get more clients is? Okay. I think that a good strategy is advertising. I 
eh, Ingrid anda, no sé dónde, <ríe> pero hemos estado trabajando. Ah, ok. So you finished? Yes. Ah, ok, I see. You are fast. Yo ¿En Nelson? Perdón. ¿En Nelson? Uh, no sé, Nelson. He didn't show up. Oh, yeah, he's sure. here. Hello, Nelson. Get out of the, the internet. I reset ah. my computer. Ah, ok. Yes. You have I problems with the internet. The moment. Ok, ok, no problem, it's ok. Se pagó. It's working, Nelson. No, it's it's a problem in my computer. Ah, yeah, but, but we can we can hear you. Se te escucha bien. We can hear you well. Okay, but the 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 the, the screen is black in in white. Yes, oh my for goodness! Moment. It's a black. It's maybe a black. it's maybe it's the setting. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah, but we can see you, and we don't see yeah, you in black. And don't worry, we don't see you in black and white. We see you like color. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so don't worry. <laughs> okay, thank you. All right. Okay. Nelson, no sé si había escuchado la actividad. Y de Torp, only restaurant is that strat strategy in okay. in the in the can can use okay. in any restaurant okay what is an important strategy the restaurant will implement to get more clients casi no escucho cuál es la estrategia una alguna o dos estrategias importantes que en Okay. Podría yeah. implementar para que es como para que Ma, el, more client. obtener más business para okay. obtener más clientes. Ok, for me. Ok, very good. Uh, just before uh, you chair, okay, let me pass the attendance quickly, all right, before you, you chair. All right, so please say I'm here, present, or over here. Ada Patricia? Adriana? Present. Ana Michelle? Present. Angela? Present, 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 teacher. All right, okay. Azalia? Present. Excellent. Darwin? Present teacher. Flor? Present teacher. Good. Gloria? Carla? Here teacher. Okay. Margarita? I'm here. Okay. Margarita? Mayra? Present. Very good. Miguel? Present teacher. Okay. That's excellent. Nelson? Present, teacher. Very good. Osmin? Here, teacher. No me menciona a mí. Ah, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Ofelia? <laughs> Osmin? Here, teacher. Present. All right. Now I mentioned Ofelia and I didn't mention Os... I mentioned Osmin and I didn't mention Ofelia, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Rafael? Well. Rafael? Not present yet, right? Rosa? Present. Sandra? Present teacher. Jansi? Present. Zulma? Zulma? Edwin? Ingrid? Present teacher. All right, very good. Lourdes? Present. Oscar? Present. And Susana? Susana? Present. Present. All right. Very good. Excellent. Right. Very good. That's excellent. Now, uh, let's, listen to, let's listen to three, three, only three participations, okay? Reporting, reporting about their classmates' answers, okay? I repeat, you will say, for example, Miguel thinks that an important strategy 
and you continue, right? Okay. And then Miguel said that, um, but some successful, I don't know. Okay, you have the answer, the, the questions there. Okay. So Miguel thinks that, Miguel said that. Okay, very good. So Miguel, do you want to start? Okay, teacher. Uh, uh, sorry, sorry. Okay, okay. Uh, my classmates are uh, Susan and Darby. Okay. Uh, uh, first, Susan. Uh, Susan, uh, yes, okay. Susan uh, thinks the important strategy your restaurant could be implemented to get more clients is uh, have promotions, variety of menus, fresh ingredients, and good staff. All right. And she she thinks uh, the successful restaurant he know her know her know sorry she knows her she know. knows she knows she knows she knows okay yes, sir. she knows this uh, hacienda real and bodeguita italiana okay uh, next uh, with only the one pizza, uh, only one okay only okay. one it's okay Excellent. okay thank you very much Miguel so that's that's the example to follow all right so let's listen to uh, let me see here Rosa can you do it please yes. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Um, my group uh, was uh, Angela and Ophelia. Okay. Um, talking about uh, talking about uh, what an important strategy uh, could implement the restaurants. Angela say said, or Angela think that uh, the restaurants could be implemented and more promotions. Promotions, yeah. Promotions, promotions yeah. For example, uh, two, how do you say, two per one? Yeah. Two per one, okay, two per one, or maybe three per two. <laughs> and discounts, discounts, attractive discounts, or maybe a familiar meal. Family combo or meal, because sometimes uh, the family comes with 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 she or with with them, with them and she. Oh my god! <laughs> okay, the family comes and together. we need a, together. Yes, and we need a a big uh, a big meal. Yeah, and. In some restaurants, uh, some restaurants, uh, what? Successful that uh, she knows, uh, she said that he knows uh, a Burger King, uh, Tony Romas, and I don't remember. <laughs> okay, that's what, it. You say, okay. you say Burger or Burger King? Burger King. Ah, Burger, Burger King. Yeah, don't Burger say Burger King, King yes. all right? It's yes. Burger King. <laughs> Burger King, yes. <laughs> Burger King. <laughs> all right, only one. It's okay, only one, Rosa, okay? You finished okay. with one? Yes, yes. Okay, thank you very much, Rosa. Okay, do we have a volunteer? Thank you, Rosa, and thank you, Miguel. We'll, ah, thank you, the thumbs up, okay? Thumbs up for Rosa and Miguel, please. Okay, thank you very much. I'm sorry, I forgot. Okay, go and give thumbs up to Rosa and Miguel, okay? Thank you very much. Okay, uh, so any volunteer? Any volunteer? Me, teacher. Okay, perfect. Adriana. In my classmate uh, are Margarita and Flor. Okay. Mm -hmm. Flor thinks uh, an important strategy restaurant called implement to get more clients are give promotions, the quality product, the ubication, and attention the clients. And floor thing, um, some so self, so self, successful, so successful, so successful restaurant and uh, our picnic steakhouse 
Pampa Argentina, and Pizza Hut. Okay, thank you very much. That's excellent. So let's go to reactions. And let's give thumbs up for Adriana, please. Okay. Thank you very much, Adriana, Miguel, and Rosa. All right, anybody else who wants to share? Alguien más que quiera hacerlo? Anyone else who wants to do it? No? No one else? Me, teacher. Okay, who me? Ingrid? Yes. Okay, Ingrid, let's listen to Ingrid. The last participation for this activity, okay? My group is uh, um, dancing. Okay. Only Yancy. Um, and Yancy seems uh, the most import, uh, important strategy uh, for uh, Yancy is focus in, in quality or customer service. Yeah. Uh, she knew, she, uh, she know a uh, many successful uh, restaurant, for example, uh, Pampa Argentina, Tartaleta and Buffalo Wings. Okay, thank you very much, Ingrid. Thank you for participating in this activity. So please, everybody, go to reactions and give thumbs up, okay, for Ingrid. Oh my God, only five, six, seven, eight, nine, Maybe. nine, nine. <laughs> okay, thank you very much. Oh, 10, 11. Oh, thank you, it's growing. Thank you very much. All right, that's very good. Uh, now let's go to the next activity for today. In the next activity for today, uh, we have a conversation. And the conversation is on page number 21, okay? So the same. What do you prefer? Let's negotiate. Do you prefer to read and I ask you questions or do you prefer to read and you ask questions to each other? Y se hacen preguntas ustedes. What do you prefer? What do you prefer? You ask questions. Teacher. Okay, okay. Then take, take three minutes, read. And afterwards, I'm going to ask you some questions, okay? So please take a moment and read the conversation. Read for comprehension, okay? Lean para comprender, read for comprehension. In this moment, it's not pronunciation. It's reading for comprehension, okay? Okay, are you ready? Yes. Yes, all right, so the conversation is on page number 21, okay? Page number 21, okay? Are you ready for the question? So please, in case you have the answer, go to reactions and raise your hand. The first person to raise the hand will have the opportunity to answer the question, okay? No se me adelanten a responder antes de que les los asigne, okay? Please, all right? 
So please listen. I ask the question, listen and raise your hand. When you have the answer, I will tell you, okay, Susana, what is the answer? And then you share the answer, please, okay? So let's start. Uh, question number one, uh, what is Jennifer doing? What is Jennifer doing? Okay, Carla, what is Jennifer doing? Jennifer doing checking the number of people who come, who come in a regular in a regular basis. Basis, yeah, that's right. Basis. Thank you, Carla. She is checking the number of people who come to the restaurant in a regular yeah. basis. Thank you very much, Carla. Thank you very much. Now let's see number two. Um, what is Mr. Mott thinking about? What is Mr. Mott thinking about Lourdes? He's thinking about the new marketing strategies. Very good. He's thinking about the new marketing strategies. strategies. Very good. Strategies. Thank you very much, Strategy. Lourdes. Strategies. Strategies. Okay, thank you very much. Question number three. Uh, obviously, they are in a restaurant, right? Okay, obviously they are in a restaurant. Okay, so question number three. How often do they change the menu? How often do they change the menu? Ana Michelle? They rarely change the menu. That's right. Or, yeah, mm -hmm. or? Or they seldom change the menu. That's right. They seldom, seldom is like casi nunca, right? or rarely, all right, or hardly ever is the same. So they rarely change the menu. Okay, that's excellent. Very good. Thank you, Ana Michelle. Let's see question number four. Um, what is the restaurant promoting? What is the restaurant promoting? All right, let's see. Um, just one question. Adriana, did you participate? Adriana, ya participaste? Did you participate? No? Yes, teacher. Yes. All right. So let's listen to Rosa. Okay. Uh, okay, Rosa. No, in the uh, question, no. Ah, okay, okay, okay. I'm sorry then. Okay, Adriana then. Okay, Adriana. Okay. So what are what is the restaurant promoting, Adriana? <laughs> a promoting a desert every week. A desert. A desert. A desert. <laughs> A it's desert. Poster. Uh, what is the dif What is the difference between between desert and dessert? A dessert. A dessert. A dessert. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay. I sorry, so, teacher. No, it's okay. We are learning. Estamos aprendiendo. We are learning. Okay. Don't worry. Okay. So you say dessert. Okay. They are dessert. from. What is the correct pronunciation, teacher? Dessert. 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 For food, right? For food, you say dessert, and for the for the very sunny area, you say desert. Okay, the Sahara. desert. Oh, yeah, Sahara okay. Desert, for example. Okay, yeah, desert. Okay, thank you very much, Adriana. Thank you for your answer. The answer is okay. The problem was in the pronunciation. Okay, but the answer is okay. All right. But now you know. Ahora ya sabes. Thank you, teacher. Y todos, porque yo creo que todos tenían alguna confusión ahí. Everybody had a confusion. And you helped us, all right? Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> the last question. Um, do in the restaurant, okay, in the restaurant, because they are in the restaurant, do they give promotional items? Do they give promotional items in the restaurant? Ana Michelle, sorry, you can participate. Rosa, sorry, because you participated. Let's give the chance to somebody else, I'm sorry. Rosa, no participate. Ah, Rosa, I'm sorry, Rosa didn't participate. I'm sorry, no, Rosa. Teacher. I'm sorry. Okay, Rosa, so do they give promotional items? No, they never give a promotion. They never, they never give away promotional items. Yes. Okay, thank you very oh, much, Rosa. Items. Okay. Yes, okay. Thank you very much, everybody, for your answers, okay? Now let's go to the conversation again. And let's focus on pronunciation this time. So this time don't focus on comprehension, focus on pronunciation, okay? So listen carefully, please, and pay attention to the pronunciation. Hello, Jennifer, how is it going? Just fine, Mr. Matt. 
I am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. That sounds good. Look, I am thinking about the new marketing strategies and I want to know some things. Tell me, sir, how often do we change the menu? Menu, menu, all right? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional item? No, sir, we never do. Listen again. Hello, Jennifer. How is it going? Just fine, Mr. Mott. I am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. That sounds good. Look, I am thinking about uh, new marketing strategies and I want to know some things. Tell me, sir, how often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional item? No, sir, we never do. Conversation on page 21, okay? Only three minutes to practice, okay? Only three minutes to practice, all right? So let's go in pairs and let's practice for three minutes, okay? So take advantage, please. No dejen de practicar. Practice, 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 and practice. Okay, don't say we finished, teacher, we finished. No, practice, okay? Hasta que termine el minuto que le doy, okay? Yeah, so please go and practice. Take advantage of time, okay? So let's go then. Okay, let me recreate the groups quickly. All right, let's go. Tell me, sir. How often do we change the, men the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional item? No, sir. We never do. I start now. Yeah. Hello, Jennifer. How is it going? Just fine, Mr. Mott. I am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. That sounds good. Look, I am thinking about the new marketing strategies and I want to know some things. Tell me, sir. How often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional item? No, sir. We never do. Okay. okay. Item and dessert. Item and dessert. dessert. Item dessert. for you, Susana, and dessert for Lourdes. Dessert. Okay, dessert. 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 Yeah, dessert, dessert. No, dessert. Okay. Dessert. dessert. Yes. Okay. Dessert. dessert. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Hello, Jennifer. How is it going? That's fine, Mr. Moti. I am just checking the number of people who come in on a regular basis. That sounds good. Look, I am thinking about new marketing strategies and I want to know some things. Tell me, sir. <laughs> okay. Uh, that sounds good. Look, I'm thinking about the new marketing strategies and I want to know some things. 
Tell me, sir. How often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promotion a dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional item? No, sir. We never do. Hello, Jennifer. How are no, you? Me ah, sí, sí. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Hello, Jennifer. Who, who it is going? Just before you start, uh, you say item. Item, promotional item, okay? Item. Item, item. Okay, Just continue. Item. Yeah, continue. Hello, Jennifer. Who it is going? Item. Um, that's fine, Mr. Mott. I'm just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. That's so good. Look, I am thinking about new marketing strategy, strategies. Strategy. And I want a strategy. 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 Strategies. Strategy. 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 Yeah. Strategies. Mm -hmm. And I want to know some things. Tell me, sir. How often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional item? Item. Item. No, sir. We never do. Item. Hello, Jennifer. Who is? <laughs> Los cinco segundos. <laughs> Okay, uh, well, just uh, let's uh, check the pronunciation of some words, okay, for everybody. Uh, for estrategia, the pronunciation is strategy, strategy, all right? Strategy, strategy. For articulos, you say items, okay? Promotional items, I, items, all right? Yeah, and basically that, all right? So thank you very much uh, for practicing. Thank you very much. Now let's go to the next activity, okay? This time you won't share. You have shared too much here on the, on the sessions, okay? So listen, uh, on this part, uh, we have some, um, some frequency adverbs, okay? Do you remember frequency adverbs? We have started this topic before. Este tema yes. Ya se yes, yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay, uh, first question. What is the purpose of frequency adverbs? Any idea? What is the purpose of frequency adverbs? Indicate frequency. <laughs> exactly, simple as that, all right? Simple as that, to indicate frequency, all right? To indicate frequency. So here we have some, all right? We have like six, I think. We have always, all right? And we have never on the other side, okay? So they are like opposites, all right? Always is like very regularly. Never, it's like, you know, never, right? Never. But we have some times too, all right? So after always, we can have some time. So this is number one in frequency, okay? So this is num number two. Seldom, rarely, and hardly ever, they have the same purpose, okay? The same purpose. So this is number three, and this is number three. Okay, these are number three. And this is number four in frequency. So in frequency, always is the most frequent. Es el más frecuente. Sometimes is the, is the second most frequent of this list. De esta lista, sometimes es el segundo más frecuente. Sometimes is a veces, right? And seldom, rarely, and hardly ever son los que son menos frecuentes. It's like casi nunca, rara vez, all right? And rarely is not frequent at all, all right? Este sí no es para nada frecuente. So you say never, never, all right? So no day, very good. And what is the position of these adverbs in the sentence? Uh, we have some examples here. We often, we always, and we regularly, okay? We have others here, okay? So um, often is like before sometimes, tiene más frecuencia, okay? Often, all right? Now, Similar what? sometimes. 
Mm, it's not, uh, often is more frequent than sometimes, okay? Es más frecuente que el sometimes, el often. Okay. Y, yeah, because often in Spanish is like a menudo, all right? So it's like usualmente, all right? It's more frequent. And regularly, regularmente is like sometimes, let's say. Regularly is like sometimes, okay, in frequency, okay? Uh, but now let's look at the position. Where is Where do we put the frequency adverbs? ¿Dónde los ponemos? Where do we put them? Before the verb. Before the verb. The, 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 the next, the subject. Exactly. Before the verb or next to the subject. Okay. Ah. Antes del verbo o después del eh, sujeto. sujeto. Después del pronombre, sorry. Después del pronombre o antes del verbo. All right. So in between, they go in between, van en medio del sujeto y del verbo. They go in between. All right. So we can say sometimes at the end. All right. You can say, for example, <laughs> Uh, we change the menu sometimes, for example. That's possible. Eso es posible. Okay? Pero principalmente para sometimes. We change the menu always. Mm -mm. Gra grammatically is not correct. Grammaticalmente no es correcto. Grammatically is not correct. So do you have any questions? Do you have any questions? So I repeat. In frequency, always is the most frequent. The second most frequent is often. Okay, often is the second most frequent. Sometimes and regularly are like the third most frequent. Okay, los tres más los los terceros más frecuentes, the third most frequent, all right? And seldom, rarely, and hardly ever, the fourth most frequent. And never is not frequent at all, all right? Este en lo absoluto, okay? It's not frequent, okay? Very good. Now, um, any question before you practice? Any question before you practice? No. No questions. It's clear, right? This is like a review. Basicamente, esta es como un pequeño repaso. It's like a little review because you studied these topics before. Okay, so if you have no questions, then let's practice, okay? So the idea is that using this, on these spaces, all right, on the spaces here, and using these frequency adverbs, the idea is that you write some sentences about your activities at the workplace, okay? Something you always do, something you rarely do, something you hardly ever do, seldom, some, something that you sometimes do and something that you never do, okay? So go ahead. You can say, for example, I always work from Monday to Friday. Okay, is one example, right? I always work from Monday to Friday. Rarely. I rarely oh. visit clients or I rarely answer the telephone. I don't know, all right? So these are your own examples. These, these examples are about your activities, okay? Six examples, go ahead. Any question? Or está claro que van a hacer? It's clear what you have to do. Clear teacher. Okay, perfect. So this uh, is on page number 22, okay? Activity five, page number 22. Page number 22, teacher. activity five, yeah? Yeah. Um, yes, teacher. Rarely is... Uh... Casi nunca. Yeah, Así. yeah. I mean, the, the, the idea of seldom, hardly ever, rarely, they are used with the same purpose. Básicamente tienen casi el mismo propósito, okay? Like okay. casi nunca, rara vez, all right? Okay, teach. Thank yes. you. So hardly, hardly ever, rarely, seldom, right? Same purpose.
Ok, uh, mientras están trabajando, solo quiero mencionar algo acerca de las sesiones uno a uno, ¿ok? Para las sesiones uno a uno, la recomendación es que ya, ya traigan algo preparado para preguntar, ¿ok? Ya traigan algo como listo. Si entienden la clase perfectamente y no tienen preguntas de la clase, eso está bien, perfecto, ¿ok? Pero tal vez aprovechen el tiempo para saber de otra cosa que quieran saber o, do, o de otro tema que quieran discutir conmigo, ¿ok? Eh, por ejemplo, no recuerdo si fue Carla, no recuerdo quién fue exactamente. Traía un tema muy, muy interesante, ¿ok? Que entendía la clase, pero traía un tema muy interesante del que quería saber un poco más. Y al final esa es la idea, que aprovechen esos 10 minutos que tienen, ¿ok? Pero si yo estoy casi con cucharita, así queriéndole sacar de qué, de qué quieren que les hable, es bastante difícil, ¿ok? Porque yo estoy como proponiéndoles de qué pero mira, y esto, y el vocabulario que hemos visto, porque no, 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 o sea, no tienen ninguna pregunta, ¿ok? La idea es que aprovechemos esos 10 minutos, ¿ok? Así que si entienden la clase, perfecto, eso está bien. Traigan otra, otra cosa entonces para que practiquemos, ¿ok? Para que aprovechemos bien esos 10 minutos, ¿ok? Teacher, yes, Flor. I have a question. Tell me, Flor. Eh, hoy me toca la sesión a mí. No yes. recuerdo si es ahora o el otro viernes. Today. Ah. It's today. Sí, por eso te decía sí. a ratos. Flor, today you have the one-on-one -on -one session. <laughs> ah, creo que no, 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 no lograste. No, I know. no, no entendí. Sí, es que estaban haciendo otra cosa cuando te dije, por eso no lograste captar la idea, quizás. Uh -huh. ah, yeah, but, it's, okay. but it's today. But it's today for you. Oh. Okay, thank you. Okay, okay. Teacher. Yes, Ingrid. Eh, yo que estoy como oyente ahorita, voy a tener un one-on-one. -on -one. Text me. Text me, please. Sí, yes. Text me, all right. Text me, and I will explain to you, all right. Me, me mandas un texto y yo te explico con todo gusto, okay? Okay. Yeah. Teacher, is work meetings or meeting works? What is the idea in Spanish? <laughs> Reuniones de trabajo. Ah, work meetings. Work meetings. Yes, we have work meetings, all right? En inglés, cuando se usa un adjetivo y un sustantivo, en este caso lo que estás preguntando, Margarita, en español se dice reunión de trabajo. Reuniones de trabajo, perdón, pero en inglés se cambia el orden en estos casos. Okay? You change the order. ¿Ya? Yeah. O se invierten las palabras, más bien. Ok, okay. Uh, in the meantime, I will pass the attendance the last time. Mientras terminan los demás, les paso asistencia. I will pass the attendance, ok? The last time, Ada. Adriana. Present. Ana Michelle. Present. Very good. Azalia. Present. Angela. Present, teacher. All right. Darwin. Present, teacher. Very good. Flor. Present. Gloria. Carla. Here, teacher. Margarita. Present. Mayra. Present. Miguel. Present, teacher. Nelson. Present, teacher. Ofelia. Ofelia. Okay, okay, okay. Osmin. Here, teacher. Rafa. Sandra. Mi Rosa. Present teacher. Okay, Rosa. <laughs> Present. <laughs> All right, I'm sorry. Jancy. Present. Very good. Zulma. <clears throat> Edwin, Ingrid, present. Lourdes, I'm here, teacher. Oscar, present. And Susana, 
Excellent teacher. Okay, excellent. That's pretty good. Okay, so please, uh, when you finish, go to reactions and raise your hand. When you finish, please. What Margarita did, lo que hizo Margarita, what Margarita did, all right? Thank you, Darwin. Que el foro de discusión para la actividad que hicieron, que hicieron ayer ya está habilitado para que vayan y agreguen la información, la información de escritura, ¿ok? Acerca de unas oraciones que escribieron. So go and check it out, please. Vayan a la plataforma y lo revisan en discusión, ¿ok? Todos los temas y ahí les va a aparecer el foro acerca de la actividad. El número de foro es... Es el número 6. Session 6. Okay. Session 6, module 6. Sí, porque he revisado los otros y no veo nada. Sí, está en el... Es que lo subí hoy. En la, en la tarde. Ajá, es session six, okay. session seis, session six. Ok. Sí. Yeah. All right. Y el de hoy se lo voy a subir igual mañana durante el día, lo que están haciendo ahorita, what you are doing in this moment, ok? Oh my goodness, what a musicón. <laughs> what a musicón, I listen there. <laughs> who, has that, who has that musicón over there? <laughs> you sing English, Darwin. Ah, it's Darwin. Darwin is the one with that musicón. <laughs> The, the neighbor of someone. Ah, it's the neighbor. No. Okay. <laughs> it's not Darwin, all right? It's, it's not Darwin. It's Friday. It's Friday. I love you yeah. the angel blue. <laughs> it's your neighbor, Darwin. It's not you. It's your neighbor. Your neighbor <laughs> next door. Your neighbor next door. Okay. After the class, Darwin is going to the party. <laughs> I think. Creo que creo que ya se está preparando. <laughs> yeah, it's true. <laughs> I listen to music in English and lyrics, teacher. Excellent. Very good. That, that's the point. So uh, if you listen to this kind of musicón in English, okay, you have to translate the song from Spanish to English, okay? Hay que traducir la, 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 la canción de español a inglés y la canta en inglés and you sing it in English, okay? For the one who is listening to this music, para quien estaba escuchando esta música, okay? I don't know if, I think it was not Darwin, okay? I think it was somebody else. Creo que... <laughs> I think that you blame Darwin, but Darwin was not listening to that music. A él lo culparon. You blame Darwin. <laughs> Azalia fue. Okay. Ah, okay. Azalia was the one. <laughs> All right, uh, so basically it's 10 one already. Okay, if you see, if you look at the time and it's Friday, as somebody says, right? And I don't want to take your time, okay? So listen, I uh, just finish uh, the sentences and tomorrow uh, you will share with the class, okay? You will share your sentences. I mean, not tomorrow. Tomorrow, no, teacher. Ya me perdí en la semana, yo también, okay? <laughs> <laughs> and on Monday... On Monday. Se me a conectar Monday. solito. I think I'll do it. Creo que sí. 
y si no, y si, y si no se conectan, les voy a poner inasistencia. Ay, no. Azalia. All right. So, uh, Lela, on Lela. Monday. Azalia, on Monday. Me está desconcentrando. Yes. So, please, uh, on Monday, uh, you will have the chance uh, to share, okay, the sentences with your classmates. Uh, so, please, try to finish. And also, tomorrow, uh, you will share on the on the discussion, okay? So go to discussion tomorrow and check and share the sentences too. It's the same instruction, okay? So it's the same activity, but it's writing, okay? Very good. So everybody, thank you for connecting today. Solo se queda flor. Have a good night and have a good weekend, all right? Thank you. Have a good weekend. Thank you, teacher. Dream. Sorry, teacher. Right. Oh, it's okay. Don't worry. Monday. It's part of Friday. Right. Right. Good night. Good night. Good Bye, everyone. Bye, bye. 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 All right, Flor. So this space is for you. Okay, teacher. I am um, practice the conversation. All right. You want to practice the conversation? Yes. The the conversation. I mean today's conversation, right? Yes. Yes. All right. Yes. So, uh, you want the pronunciation, or you want to practice with me, or? Uh, with you. <laughs> okay, let me give you the pronunciation first and then we practice, okay? Vamos a okay. pronunciar primero. Aquí sí podemos hacer el repetition, okay? Porque solo eres tú. <laughs> so let's do the repetition first and then we practice, okay? Okay. Okay, let's repeat. Hello, Jennifer, how is it going? Hello, Jennifer, how is it going? Is how it how going? is it going, all right? How is it going? How how is it? It is going. Is it? How is, is it? It is it going. How it is? Is it? How is it going? How is it going? All right, do it slower. All right. Hello, Jennifer. How is it going? Hello, Jennifer. How is it going? Good. As you improve, you can do it faster. Okay. Just fine, okay. Mr. Matt. Just fine, Mr. Matt. I am just checking the number of people. I am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. Who come in a regular basis. That sounds good. That sounds good. Look, I am thinking about the new marketing strategies. Look, I am Thinking about new marketing strategies. 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 Exactly. strategies. Yes. Okay. And I want to know some things. And I want to know some things. Tell me, sir. Tell me, sir. How often do we change the menu? How often do you we change the menu? How often do we change the menu? How often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. However, we are prom promoting a dessert every week. Promoting. 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 Exactly. Do promoting. we ever... Uh, promoting, promoting. Promoting. Do we ever give a promotional item? Do we ever give a promotional item? Item. 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 Promotional item. Item. No, sir, we never do. No, sir, we never do. Okay, let's repeat uh, one more time. Hello, Jennifer. How is it going? Hello, Jennifer. How is it going? Just fine, Mr. Mott. Just fine, Mr. Mott. I am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. I am just, I am just checking the number of people 
who come in a regular basis. That sounds good. Then that sounds good. Look, I am thinking about the new marketing strategies. Look, I am thinking about new thinking about thinking about new marketing strategies. And I want to know some things. I want to know some things. Tell me, sir. Tell me, sir. How often do we change the menu? How often do we change the menu? Mm, let me see. Well, we seldom change the menu. Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. However, we are promoting promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional item? Do we ever give a promotional item? No, sir, we never do. No, sir, we never do. Now you do it alone, Flor. Ahora hazlo tú solo y solo te escucho. Everything, okay. every, all of it, todo, everything, okay? Okay. Hello, Jennifer, how is it going? Just fine, Mr. Mott. I am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. That sounds good. Look, I am thinking about new marketing strategy and I want to know something. Tell me, sir, how often do we change the menu? We well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional item? No, sir, we never do. Okay, very good. That's excellent. Much better. Uh, only okay. we are having difficulty only with the word strategies. Strategies. A strategies. So repeat strategies. it many times later, right? But repeat it many times. Strategies, strategies. Strategies. Yes, that's strategies. right. Strategies. Now strategies. let's pronounce together. I will be Mr. Mott and you will be Jennifer, all right? Yeah. Okay. Okay, okay. let's do it. Hello, Jennifer. How is it going? Just fine, Mr. Mott. I am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. That sounds good. Look, I am thinking about new marketing strategies and I want to know some things. Tell me, sir. How often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional item? No, sir. We never do. Okay, that's excellent. Now let's switch roles, okay? Now you start and I go uh, with Jennifer's role. Okay. Hello, Jennifer. How is it going? Just fine, Mr. Mott. I am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. That's some good look. I am thinking about I am thinking about new marketing strategy and I want to know something. Tell me, sir. How often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever get a promotional item? No, sir, we never do. Okay. Strategies. Let's repeat. Strategies. 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 Very good. Strategies. Strategies. Yes. Strategies. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, teacher. All right, it's my pleasure. I don't know if you have any other question or that's it? No, no, no. Everything okay? Everything okay. <laughs> okay, perfect. Thank you very much for connecting, Flor. Thank you, teacher. All right, have, goodbye. Uh, have a good week. Weekend. Weekend.
Thank you very much. You too. <laughs> okay. Good okay, night. bye. Good night.